There's this professor of cognitive science at the University of Toronto named John Viveki. He likes to tell this story where he asks his students how many of them are in really satisfying romantic relationships. Then he asks them, how many of you would want to know if your partner is cheating on you, even if it means the destruction of the relationship? 95% of his students raise their hands. Faveki then asks the students why, to which they quickly respond, because it's not real. Faveki tells this story to demonstrate how we intuitively desire reality and how quickly we will dispense with an illusion once we realize it is not representative of reality. He likes to point out that when he does this experiment, even his most cynical students will spontaneously demonstrate their deep need for the real. The tension between the illusory and the real goes back centuries. For example, in his work The Republic, the ancient Greek philosopher Plato presents the allegory of the cave. In this allegory, Plato describes prisoners trapped in a cave from birth. A wall divides the prisoners from free-roaming people who cast shadows against the cave wall with a fire. To the prisoners, these two-dimensional shadows represent reality, for these shadows are all that they know. However, the shadows are merely illusions. Reality lies outside the cave, where the sun illuminates the shadows of our ignorance and objects are experienced in three-dimensional fullness. Faveki's experiment with his students cleverly demonstrates that most of us will gladly sacrifice illusory shadows for the real once we become aware that we are being deceived, even if it comes at a great cost, even if it means sacrificing a relationship with someone we love. AI art can be likened to a shadow being cast against a wall in Plato's cave, or a romantic relationship in which your partner is secretly cheating on you. In other words, AI art is not real. AI art generators may have the capacity to produce images that seem alluringly beautiful, imaginative and sophisticated. But that beauty, imagination and sophistication is nothing more than an illusion. Put bluntly, AI art is meaningless. It does not matter how exquisite an AI image may be. Once I discover that an image has been produced by AI, it becomes as interesting to me as a blank piece of paper. Like a blank piece of paper, even the greatest of all AI images will be void of a human mark, save for the lines of code embedded within it, which are as artistic and relevant as the lumberjacks who deliver trees to the paper mill. There is simply no substance in AI art, no creative expression, no sacrifice of time, no commitment to a craft. There is no hard-won observational skill, no imagination, no relatability, no struggle. There is no suffering or pain. There is no keen sense of perception, no insights, no vision, no self-doubt, no victory, no tragedy. There is no ambition, no faith, no hard work, no talent, no contemplation. No human touch, no dream, no intention. There is no heart, no mystery, no voice, no soul, no emotion, no story, no meaning. Everything that makes art worthy of our attention is absent in the art that is produced by artificial intelligence. AI art eliminates the very creative process itself, which might be the most concerning aspect of its emergence. Most creative people will tell you the end product is not the main event. For the artist, it's the otherworldly experience of being lifted into an alternate state of creative consciousness. And it is here, in this realm of beauty, where the artist embarks on his adventure. It begins with the warmth of an idea, followed by the torment of the blank canvas, the rush of one's first mark, and then the ecstasy of revelation, the magical grip of the flow state the unexpected wave of crushing self-doubt, and then the victorious return to the vision. Finally, it's the last touch before the artist must surrender to the end 
and step back. He concludes by quietly contemplating the fruits of his efforts. But perhaps it's not the final piece which draws his attention, but the comforting mystery of the almost divine experience that is embedded within the work. AI art is not real. It is not real in the same way that a shadow cast against a cave wall is not a real reflection of the object it represents. AI art is not real in the same way that a relationship is not real if your partner is cheating on you. You are of course free to continue the relationship. You are free to eliminate the creative process from the production of art. And you may remain in the cave with your shadows. But that is all AI art will ever be. A shadow in a cave, convincing only to prisoners. A mere illusion that depends upon various forms of deception to be sustained 